I've put nine African American judges on the bench. Yeah. Eliminated the death penalty. Oh, I like that. Um, because he I got a long standing record of Absolutely. of um our rights yes. here as really a people. I do too. <laughs> Yeah, man. Thanks so much. Appreciate it, James. They care about jobs. They care about schools that their kids go to. And, um, uh, and I've, I think I've tackled all of those issues. My opponent is a one-trick pony. Let me just talk about abortion. Let me borrow a half million dollars from my, my billionaire friend in Charlottesville. Let me flood the airwaves with that. And uh, let me try to uh, steal a state senate seat. The last two years, the last two years, two and a half years that I've been in the Senate, put nine African American judges on the bench. Um, I have, you know, uh, six African American children. They, I, I want, they will possibly someday go before judges. I want those judges to be compassionate, to show mercy, and to believe with the, in their heart with second chances. I think it was Friday or Saturday. Somebody hit my house Friday or Saturday. I came home and had... Went on the door. Yeah. Yeah, so my little son... There, in fact, there are a lot of things I could be talking about as it pertains to my opponent. But more specifically, he has been unreliable on the issues that matter most in this district. If you check his record, not only has he been, uh, not only has he been out of sync when it pertains to reproductive health, but you can look at his vote on education matters. He has not uh, supported public schools in the way they deserve to, particularly in a district like this. He has voted against protections when families were at their most vulnerable as it relates to housing protections, as it relates to utility re relief assistance. I can go down the list, environmental protections, he has been on the wrong side of. And so when you talk about a predominantly minority community, a strong democratic community, he has been on the wrong side of those issues. I don't remember getting back this oh. deep into okay. uh, We know Joe, mm -hmm. you know. But so that's the only thing, you know. What I will say is, if you know Joe, mm -hmm. then you know that he also has just not been doing everything he said he was going to do when he got into this position of power in the Senate. Mm -hmm. So if you like him as a lawyer, mm -hmm. go let him be a lawyer. That doesn't mean he needs to be a senator. You know what I'm saying? Right, right. Because we, I didn't say we like him. I said we know him. <laughs>